Oh my god, it was all over my head. I, Lee Stephen Foe, take you, Georgina Mary Evangelos, to be my wife. To have and to hold. From this day forwards, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, to death do us part, according to God's holy law. In the presence of God, I make this vow. I, Georgina Mary Evangelos, take you, Lee Stephen Foe, to be my husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, till death us do part, according to God's <laughs> holy law, in the presence of God, I make this vow. Lee and I have been friends since we were three years old when we started playgroup. I could list various antics we got up to in the youth, but I'm sure Lee will happily bribe me to keep quiet, and also I don't give away my secrets. Lee is the most hardworking, trustworthy, and willing to do anything to help a mate. This is what makes him such a great mate, but also make him such a great husband. Lee has been the happiest I've ever known him since he's been with G, and adding the gorgeous Molly to become a family. Without further ado, let's raise our glasses and toast happy couple to Lee and G. Well done. Hey. Hey. <laughs> so, from the very first meeting with Lee in 2012, we were impressed by how well mannered and how polite he was. Always well groomed, articulate, and with a great sense of humour for someone so young as well. Show maturity and obviously to my wife Amanda and I, a boy who was obviously brought up the correct way and a definite credit to his own family. The more we got to spend time with him, his hard working work ethic and the way he treated Georgina was um, by the least to say impressive. How she was always smiling and happy when Lee was around. As time passed, we enjoyed some great family holidays and Lee became more like a friend than my daughter's suitor. Along with his constant fixing of anything and everything, from my lawnmower to my ageing van, only then did I realise what an asset he could be to my family. <laughs> In December 2019, Lee asked if I would like to go for a curry, as it was becoming a custom pre-Christmas for boyfriends of my daughters, Lucy and Grace, to do this. Except this year, it was only to be Lee and myself. <laughs> it was on this occasion when he nervously said to me they had something he wanted to ask. I thought he'd forgotten his wallet and wanted me to stump up the bill. <laughs> Thankfully, it was the best question I had ever been asked. My daughter's hand in marriage. I, of course, said yes. It was so natural I told him that we all felt that he was already part of our family and I would be honoured to call him my son-in-law. So here we are all today. Well, that's, that's Lee. Georgina, I give you this ring of a sign of our marriage. With my body, I honour you. All that I am, I give to you. All that I have, I share with you. Within the love of God, Father, Son and Holy Spirit. Lee, I give you this ring as a sign of our marriage. With my body, I honour you. All that I am, I give to you. And all that I have, I share with you. Within the love of God, Father, Son and Holy Spirit. That's because we're standing up here. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, absolute joy and delight that I now introduce to you the new Mr. and Mrs. Foe. We may kiss the
Now to my daughter Georgina. Born in America and brought to England as a two-year-old child, our beautiful Georgina has always been a joy to bring up in our happy home. Timid, soft-spoken, gentle-natured. All attributes inherited from her mother. Georgina grew up to be a delight from her first days at school. Amanda and I knew she was always going to be studious, well-behaved. If only she could just speak up a bit more, the teachers would say at open evenings. From junior to secondary school, dolls to make up, bikes to horses, growing into a teenager, giggling with her friends and becoming a role model to her younger sisters. To college and to university, wanting to become a school teacher, learning to drive, drink and find her way through adolescence. More driving lessons than Sterling Moss. <laughs> her driving instructor, I heard, retired to an island in the Caribbean on the strength of her ability. <laughs> But like most things worthwhile in life, nothing comes easy. But as we always told her, to never give up, ever, and you will always win. She has tackled highs and lows in her young life and has dealt with them with the same determination that has driven her through. The loss of Freddie was a horrendous experience and a tragedy that nobody had been expecting. But Lee and Georgina showed such fortitude and strength throughout that I've never seen such love for each other as I did at this very sad time. Moving to Bookham to a new home and fresh start was only overshadowed by the birth of our granddaughter Molly. An utter ray of sunshine. We've all become Peppa Pig fanatics and can recite all songs that go with it. Georgina, you have been, you are now and will always be our kind. <laughs> A truly superb teacher and mother. A wonderful big sister to Lucy and Grace. An honour and a privilege to be called your father. May you, Lee, and your future children lead a happy, a prosperous and a healthy life. May all your days be filled with the happiness you deserve. May I thank God for blessing me with you. Enjoy your special day with Lee, and thank you for being who you are. I love you, you are perfect. On behalf of my wife and I, we'd both like to thank, eh? My wife. My wife. <laughs> I said it quickly. We'd both like to thank everyone that joined us today on this special day. A lot of you have travelled many miles, including Cornwall, Chesterfield Yay! and France. So thank you all for coming. As we all know, today's like this should, we should cherish. I've especially thanked Regina for today. If it wasn't for us, military style planning and the colour coded spreadsheets, the day just wouldn't be the same. Talking to G, uh, Georgina, now my wife. <laughs> I want to say you always look gorgeous, but today you're absolutely stunning. And I feel the luckiest man alive and I can't believe you said yes. But seriously, today I'm so lucky to marry my, marry my best friend. We've had one amazing journey so far and achieved so much in our nine years together with so many great memories and becoming a family. I can't wait to enjoy many more great adventures together. So with that, please raise your glasses to my wife, Georgina. <laughs> <laughs>